hey guys welcome back to the channel so guys today's video we are going to be talking guys i have something to like discuss with you guys so let me know what you think in the comment section just like leave your opinion down there so guys it's another shower routine yeah guys i have some products that are quite new that you guys know that i love like my dove for me is like classic so i love using dove a shower gel because i just love how smooth and how silky it just makes me feel at the end of the shower like perfect results so guys here yeah, let me just make my face and neck scrub very important and we just like get into this topic and while we have our shower at the end of it so do not skip any part of this video the talking aspect and the shower aspect please do not skip like share and subscribe to the channel and you are very very welcome guys so let's just get started um so guys yeah why can men cheat but women can't like cheats you know this is something that i don't really, i just can't really understand because when it comes to like couples kind of thing a man and a woman i don't know why it has always been like that because men always pretend with a lot from women even almost the impossible so men can cheat women cannot cheat and then you see i'm tired of eating one food one food one food every time up or soup up or soup so i just want to like go for like assorted vegetable soup so i will feel like changing i feel like you know trying out some other things that are new that is the main so i the lady can't i try something new can't i go for a wedding soup can't i go for banga soup can't i go for maybe delicious uh, uh, uh what is it called uh, uh, a, a bitter leaf soup must it be just the man that can cheat and women cannot cheat so me i don't really understand this so guys i'll just keep talking while i focus my camera on the face scrub that we are going to be doing for today so guys here is my salt so i just like two full spoon of salt so we're just gonna add a little bit of olive oil or whatever if it's almond oil any oil of your choice or coconut oil so but i'm just gonna have this olive oil the comments you can see that it's not too much and yeah we we'll just add our honey i love honey honey for me is just honey so we're just gonna add a little bit of honey and we mix. So today is gonna to be my face and neck scrub. So you can as well try it out. It's kind of very helpful. It helps to exfoliate your face, your neck, anywhere you want to apply it. And it just helps take off those dead skin and make your skin very bright and shiny and soft at the same time. Yeah, that is what we are in for on this channel. And why can men cheat? Women cannot cheat. Please. If you know the answer to this question, let me know in the comment section because they always say because at the end of it all, men can do what they want while women cannot do what they want. If a man can be tired of eating okra soup every time, what makes you think that I, the woman, is not tired of eating okra soup like that? That are always kind of very tired. They want to try something new. They want to taste something new. They don't care if the woman knows or not. And men like this, they always pretend they are wife. They want. They always pretend to have the best wife. Their wife should be hundred percent faithful. When I mean faithful, their wife should be like, you know, faithful to them. Those kind of men say, like that, when the wife, the phone rings, they're just like, who be that? Who they call you? Who is that? Who is on the line with you? What are you doing on the line? Who is there? They want to know everything. They want to know who you're talking to. They want to know what you're doing, where you're going to. But when it comes to them, they are kind of very, very protective when it comes to their property, their wife, and things like that. But on the other way around, the woman cannot do the same. And they want you to be 100% faithful and when they are not faithful i don't know why it works like that like as for me my husband is not a jealous type at, at, at all at all at all that does not mean maybe i'm kind of um you know i can do something stupid because i really have to respect myself and respect my husband you know so but at the end of it all it is not right for women to be 100% faithful to a man that is not 1% faithful to her so why can't be equal right when it comes to marriage aspects because, because i think it takes two to make a marriage work it takes two it's just something about me and you working it out not just one side because no matter how many efforts that you know, the woman is putting and the man is not putting any efforts it's not going to work so it's just take two people to make this work and you know um, and get great results so men that cheat that pretend their wife to be 100 percent faithful if you can be faithful to yourself, you know you are not faithful, faithful to the woman. So why do you want the woman to be one million percent faithful to you? I don't get that people say. Being faithful does not really take much. 
But trust me, it's all about the respect, you know, that you have for each other. That we like, you know, you know what is wrong and you know what is right. If you have a respect for your husband or for your wife, trust me, there are some things that you will not do automatically. I love this person and I have so much respect for her, so she don't deserve things like that. But these days, men don't care. So much respect for who, as far as men, as most men are concerned, it is woman respecting them, so it's not the other way around. They are the one that needs respect, not, not them. As far as they are concerned, as far as they are concerned, they are, concerned, they are the ones that need to be respected. They are the ones that need to be pampered, not the women. So and it's very, very wrong because uh, trust me, every woman love a very caring, respectful, responsible man, a man that will treat her nice, a man that will respect her in her presence and as an absence as well. Not just because she is there and you're kind of, oh, my wife here, my wife there. So things like that. I don't really get it why some men will cheat even on the front of the woman or behind her and at the end of the day they pretend you the wife not to do the same thing I don't get it, in fact I can't ever, I can never understand this aspect if you love me you will respect me if you love me you know what is right and what is not right if you love me I believe you won't hurt me, you want me to feel good you want to like you know make me feel like a queen that that I am to you maybe so but yeah if a man wants to cheat let him cheat trust me if I want to cheat as a woman, I will still cheat and let you know because yeah, you do want you do me and you got on the best. It's not as if maybe I'm kind of doing it just to like maybe to get back at you. Absolutely not. But trust me, when there is no respect in a relationship, things like this happen. Because when you don't have respect for me as a woman, when you don't regard me as a woman, as a person, as your love, as your partner, you know, trust me, things like this do happen. But it all depends on how you're able to handle it. That will make you that will make the difference as a woman or as a man. But that's just one thing that I think a lot of people are missing, and that is why today you can see that there is a lot of broken marriages. There is a lot of uh, what is it called? There is a lot of divorce everywhere. But it's just divorcing as if maybe they fell for the third marriage, stuff like that. So yeah. So guys, we are out of the shower now. I'm
feeling very, very clean. My face, my hands, my legs. So I didn't shave my armpits today because I, I don't just really feel like that's what to do. So yeah, in case don't come for me in the comment section. So I've not shaved, so I don't want to shave. So why would I come and shave when I don't want it? So anyway, guys, like what I was saying before, I just really think it's because of this. Maybe some men just took it upon yourself, like because you know you are my wife, I pay your brand price. So anything I say, you do. You know, it is all about me, the man, not the woman. So I can do what I want. You as my wife, you can't do what you want. Ha. This one, yeah, it be anyway because it is not really right. Because uh, I think when women start paying the men's uh, price. <laughs> The mess price, the groom price, you know, like the bride price or the groom price. I think that is when it will be like maybe a little bit of kind of um, equal when it comes to marriage. So <laughs> it's kind of it's cute anyway, you know. I pay my husband bride price. How do you guys? What do you guys think? Why not? Yeah, it doesn't really sound bad. <laughs> so I really think sometimes some men just took it upon yourself because I'm your husband because I marry you. They will just remove that respect, that kind of love. Because if you didn't love her in the first place, you won't marry her. That's just the truth. If she's not attracted to you one way or the other, you won't have gotten married to her. But they will just throw that out the window and just all about them. So what I say you do, you can't do this, you can't do that. Why me? I can do what I want. You are my wife. You should obey me. You should listen. You should respect me. But I, you, my husband, you cannot obey. You cannot respect. You cannot give me that 100% total love because you feel that I should be like under you. We can't be equal, so we still have a very long way to go as women when it comes to marriage life. We still have a long way to go because some men are making this things very difficult. Why some women are also making these things very, very difficult? Because I always say it takes two to make a marriage, but, but trust me, to any successful marriage, I would say kudos to the woman 70% because it's not just all about it takes two to make it work. Yeah, but it takes much more from the woman to make it work than the man. So I've just said we should just learn to love and treat our women, our husband, our wives right because it's not all about I'm your husband, you should do what I ask you to do. These are part of the problem that a lot of marriage has, you know, going through today because it's just all about the man, the woman is like nowhere to be found. That is why they have break up everywhere. Although there's still other things, other factors anyway, but trust me, I think this are still like part of it that just make it kind of um, very, very worse. So I'll just say we should just learn to love our wives and respect them because everybody deserves to be respected, be it your wife or not, because respect is reciprocal, you know, be it your wife, as a human being, it's just something very natural, you know, but when it comes to someone you love, you really want to like treat her nicely, like give her the love, the attention, the respect, the love, everything that you know that uh, she needs, you know, to be okay with you, to, you know, to be cool with you. Because trust me, when a woman is happy, the home is happy. When a woman is okay, the home will be okay. You will be okay. Your spirit will be okay. But when a woman is not okay, trust me, that house is on fire. Even you and your spirit and your system, you can never be okay because it's gonna be heat everywhere. So it's just like when it's just like treating a baby nice. When a baby is okay, the whole house will be calm. But when a baby is not okay, there's something wrong. Trust me, she will cry all through the night and day, and you will be restless. Everybody will be restless. It's just the same thing. Uh, when it comes to like treating the woman nicely. So guys, what I have for you guys today, I just want to talk about something I think is fun. Do not forget to leave your comment below. Let me know in the comment section if you love videos like this. And if you don't follow me on my second channel, that's if I think you're missing. Come check your game as it's all about fashion, fashion, styling, 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 styling. And thank you so much. A lot of you, I saw you subscribe, you know, commenting on the videos. I really do appreciate you guys. You guys are just one too much. <laughs> thank you so much and God bless you all and there. Yeah. See you all in my next video. So yeah, guys, shower for today is done. I'm just going for my outfit and it's just everyone casual chic at the same time. Can I look? And we are ready to go. So guys, let me know in the comment section about this our little fun topic. I think women should be paying men prize, good prize. I think in that way we have a little bit more privilege than what we're having now, same wife. Everyone think in the comment section that I see you all in my next video.